Last time I talked about who the most important person in your world is. And without question, that needs to be you. You need to be number one in your world. So today I want to address why. Why do you need to be number one? Well, if you're not taking care of yourself, if you're so busy being there for your kids, for your parents, for your friends, for your spouse, for everybody else in the whole wide world, you know what's going to happen? Well, two things are going to happen. One, you're going to become resentful of everybody else who's getting your attention because chances are you're not getting your fair share. You're not getting it back because people tend to live in a me, me, me world and if there's somebody taking care of their me, 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 do you really think they're going to even think that maybe you have some needs? I've seen so many women. In fact, I've lost more women friends than I can count on my fingers to the feminine diseases. And it's even spreading worse than that now. Things like breast cancer, the female cancers, the uterus, the ovarian cancer, these all are about not giving birth to your own personal ideas, needs, projects, to your own nurturing the brain cancers. That's about not doing what you want to do in life. And what I tell them is, if you don't take care of you, if you lose your health, if your family loses you, what do they do then? Well, you know what they do? They have to step forward and take care of your, themselves. So why? Why would you wait? Why would you put it off? Why would they allow you to find themselves in that position of being without you? You came here for your purpose. And while your purpose may be to help others to be the best they can be, it's not about only serving others. Mally Bierman, and you can find me over at yourrelationshipintelligence.com. And you go over there and you can pick up a gift that I have especially for you that you'll find right below this video.